First Alert Weather with meteorologist Darren Stack. Ah, nice warm start to the week out there. We'll be looking for 70s for your Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday, but Wednesday cold front's going to come in here to bring in a chance for some rain even into early Thursday morning behind that front. Yep, a noticeable chill will be heading our way. High pressure in control will keep us a little bit of a warming trend for the next two days. Low to mid 70s today, mid to upper 70s tomorrow. Partly sunny skies overhead and dry conditions across the area as that high sinks off to the east coast. That will allow the cold front to come in here late Wednesday into early Thursday. Out ahead of it, we'll watch for the development of some scattered showers and even a few thunderstorms, possibly a little strong, on Wednesday afternoon into Wednesday evening. The front will come through through the first half of the morning on Thursday, so a chance for a few showers will still be out there early in the day, but skies will clear out and that colder air will really start to move in late Thursday and into Friday. Before today, just a few clouds expected out there. Chance of showers will be offshore. We'll continue to look for mostly clear to partly cloudy skies overnight and the chance for the showers generally staying offshore. Now, some of the models try to pop up a shower or two out there for your Tuesday. Most areas are going to stay dry, so we're talking less than a 20% chance of a shower tomorrow. Better chance of an early morning shower will be on Wednesday morning. Better chance of scattered showers and thunderstorms across the area will be Wednesday afternoon overnight into early Thursday morning as that front pushes on through the area. So we'll keep an eye on that front as it a little bit closer to us and moves on through the area. Otherwise, look for a pretty nice day out there. Aside from a few extra clouds, it'll be nice. A little bit breezy down by the beaches. 73 will be your high in Myrtle's Inlet, Surfside and Myrtle Beach. Same for North Myrtle Beach, Conway and Socasty, topping out at 75. Right along with Florence and Dillon, Bennettsville, Rockingham and Laurenburg. 76 your forecast in Johnsonville, Ainer, Hartsville and Lake City. Your Grand Strand 7 day forecast looks for those 70s to stay with us through Wednesday. We'll be actually knocking on the door that 70 degree mark even on Thursday afternoon before we, we return to the low 60s on Friday with wake up temps in the low 40s. Mid 60s back in the forecast for your Saturday and we'll even see 70 degrees coming in on Sunday. Inland areas staying with those middle and upper 70s through Wednesday. Upper 60s on Thursday, barely getting to 60 degrees on Friday. Wake up temps in the upper 30s for Friday and Saturday morning. But again, a nice little warming trend coming our way for the weekend, and we do see those 70s back by Sunday. So all in all, a pretty good looking seven day forecast. We'll just have to keep an eye on that Wednesday afternoon to early Thursday time frame for a few of those stronger thunderstorms. Otherwise, have a great Monday. Get your week off to a great start. Your latest news and weather updates are always on your website, carolinalive.com.